Hey, what's up, you guys? Tom is back with another Linton's video. The wifey is here by popular demand. Say hello. Hello. And uh, we are here. She has no clue what she's doing on this video. So we are going to uh, test her knowledge uh, some point in this video. But before we get into that, just want to say thank you guys again. It is an honor to be playing on one of those electronic devices. Whether it's that cell phone, the tablet, that laptop, that brand new Apple Watch. Watch me out there. Good luck. Or that brand new big screen TV. Maybe you're watching me at home at work on a plane, a train, an automobile. Maybe you're watching me in the movie theaters right now. Maybe because you're just waiting for the movie to begin. Who knows? Wherever and however you're watching me, it is an honor. And if you guys are new to this channel, you like what you see, hit the subscribe button, comment, and like. Likes are very important. Now, you guys have asked. Some of you have asked for the wife to return. She is here. And now she has no idea what she is doing on this video, okay? I have no fragrance in front of me right now, okay? Now, doesn't. with that being said, tonight is a, uh, a pretty a cool prank? night. It's a pretty, it's not a prank. Oh. It is a cool night. Uh, scored some cool wrestling tickets. Uh, if you guys are into wrestling, if you call it down in the south, they call it wrestling. WWE or WWF, however you like to call it, I haven't seen a wrestling show ever. Um, so Not they're live. they are live for the WWE Raw tonight. So it's going to be a lot of people, crowded, busy, packed together, nice, uh, energetic atmosphere. And so, with that being said, I am going to need a fragrance that kind of. Brings that all together, okay? A uh, fragrance that says, you know what? I'm out in the open. I, I want to be seen. There's a lot of crowds. He so be beat up. This would kind of be like a... This could kind of be like a clubbing fragrance, if you will. Uh, for some of you guys that are usually on the uh, many different groups on Facebook uh, asking for suggestions. What fragrance should I wear for this occasion? Which fragrance should I wear for that occasion? So, this is like your club slash going out to the bar big environment, something like that, right? So, you're going to kind of want to be, with this fragrance, you kind of want to be a little bit loud, okay? You kind of want a loud fragrance because you're going to be out, you're going to be really spacious crowd. Um, you know, you wear something light, no one's going to smell you beside yourself. I mean, if you're going for that uh, type of thing, then you can do that. But sometimes when you go into a big crowd like this, you kind of want to be noticed. You want someone's head to turn and say, man, it's a, that smells great. So, uh, with that being said, I'm going to see if the wifey has been paying attention to any of these videos, okay? Now, she does do a lot of editing tricks and some of the other stuff behind the scenes, but does she actually know what I'm talking about when I am talking about these fragrances? So, the wifey is going to go over there, waddle her way over to that thing back there. Well, no, that's the uh, that no, thing no. right there, see? Right there. Right back there, okay? There. That is the fragrance shelf. His vault. And Ow! she is going to try to see if she can pick <laughs> out something that I personally would enjoy wearing tonight. Now, again, honestly, wear whatever you like, people, okay? Wear, don't go based off of uh, weathers and stuff like that. I think it's more of, when you're wearing a fragrance, it should be more of an occasional thing. Like, uh, depending on what occasion it is, not depending on what the weather's like, okay? because today is cold, okay, so obviously you go for a cold weather style fragrance, but if you're going into like a date night, okay, I mean, go more for the occasion, okay, mm -hmm. not for the weather, okay, so. I just go off for what I like. See? I just pick, I sniff some, like, that's it. Usually just pick stuff, okay, but I know there are some of you that really, really want a specific fragrance for these type of occasions, and with that being said, Wife, can you please go to the Waddle vault of the, the fragrance of shame over there, pick something out, bring it here, and I'll let you know if I enjoy that fragrance. Now, try to do something that it's you loud. haven't really seen me wear that much, though. Okay? And loud. So let's see if you've been paying attention. Clubbing. So you want kind of something loud, clubbing, um, mass appealing, obviously, because you're going out to the... It's also got to be something that the wifey enjoys as well, because again, I may be the one that says don't get rid of a fragrance just because your wife doesn't like it. But in this situation, if the you guys are both going out, 
then you got to make sure she likes it, okay? Because if she doesn't like it, then you got to go take a bath and reapply something different. So, with that being said, wife, come on down. You're the next contestant on <laughs> Fragrance is Right. Let's see if you can pick a good fragrance of them. Yeah, something. The alpaca, right? And uh, I will uh, kind of talk come a little on, bit like I usually do. Come on. Um, come on. You may see a dog or two uh, waddle that way, that way too as well. There's two of them. See, there you go. Okay. Uh, and you may see some. Uh, look at that. I think that's. Uh, that who is that on TV? Yeah, we don't have cable, so that's whatever the TV suggests that we watch. Um, but yeah, again, wrestling, man. I haven't seen a wrestling event. I've watched wrestling growing up. However, wrestling nowadays is kind of sucky. I watch the stuff, and it's kind of boring. I don't know if it's the, the, the wrestlers they have. Maybe they, they're not good entertainers as well. Like back in my day, The Rock, Austin, you had Hulk Hogan, Macho Man, The Warrior. All of them had great personalities. Now it's like they're kind of robots just going around. But um, anyways, let me know. What, what do you guys like to wear out in those busy environments, um, busy places and stuff like that? What are your go-to fragrances for? clubbing slash uh live events whatever you will so um eventually the wife will grab something and uh we will see okay because I'm, I'm gonna try to as she is uh coming this way she will show you on the screen hopefully she's actually listening to this she's gonna show you on the screen but i'm gonna kind of uh put this over my eyes just to see if i can guess what she picked anyways okay i'll let her spray it or whatever and see if i can guess uh, but once she's got one, I will uh, blindfold myself, and then we shall see. Again, this is the beauty of non-edited videos. You get to see her over there, bending over to get the uh, fragrance of choice. Luckily, it is blurred out. Luckily, she's fully clothed, or else uh, we probably get kicked off of YouTube. Uh, I know some of you guys might uh, be interested, but uh, you know we got to keep it PG for some of those kids that might be watching. Yeah. So, uh, who knows? But uh, she's uh, definitely, uh, look at that. She's actually getting a workout over there. She's uh, huffing and puffing, trying to find the fragrance. Uh, you know, you guys already know the Big Bad Wolf had to go through two houses before I got to the house that he can finally, uh, there was no match. Or the bear, three three uh, kids and a bear, or three bears and a, uh, whatever the lady's name was. Remember. Okay, probably not loud enough, who knows, but um, loud enough could easily just be sprayed a gazillion times to make it loud. So I think she's gonna, got something. I'm just going to go with what I thought. Come on, try yours. Okay, so I think she's got something. I'm not going to hold the bottle because, you know, sometimes when you hold those bottles, it's pretty easy to uh, pick out uh, what it is. Uh, but I'm going to let her spray it on my hand or over here in the arm. I'll let her spray it, and I'll see if I can pick what it is. Okay, that spray already sounds sounds like it's sweet. It sounds more that uh, it sound that the the sound of that sprayer sounds more of like a mist. And um, you know, I I personally like this fragrance. Um, when I first smelled it, um, at Alta. I really enjoyed it, and the reason why I wanted this fragrance is because I was going to do a video on the special day 420, if you guys know what that is. Uh, 420 is the uh, national anthem for those that like to partake in smoking herbal stuff. Uh, this would have to be that Carolina bad boy, the big thunderstorm looking bottle, because I can kind of smell that earthy, that... It's kind of sweet. You got this sweetness, and then you got that earthiness, that undertone, that earthy, uh, beautiful smell. I could be wrong. This could be. This could also be because the way the sprayer sounded sounded almost like it could have been a one million as well, which would be the gold bottle or the silver bottle, whatever one you got. But I kind of get this little bit of earthiness, so that's why I kind of went already with Bad Boy. Uh, I believe this is the. I only got one Bad Boy, so it's the Parfum Edition. 
Mm, looks kind of earthy. It's kind of sweet. It is kind of loud right here. Um, but uh, that's what I'm going with. Would I be correct? Yep. I am correct. And I think what really gave away that fragrance, and this is actually a very good clubbing fragrance. It's loud. It's sweet. A lot of uh, clubbing style fragrances are sweet. And this has that sweetness. Mm -hmm. It has that sweetness. It has that little bit of earthiness, kind of that... It, it does kind of have that cannabis note that kind of, there's a slight little bit of skunkiness back there. Not like, you know, like you're smoking a joint or nothing like that. But if you really just, now let her smell it. If you really take a real deep breath, you can kind of find this little funk in there. It's like a it's like tiny bit, note. but it's more of that sweet, kind of earthy. Um, it's kind of got this loud, thick sweetness to it. Now, me personally, this, you're going to have to wear this in an open environment, okay? If you wear that in an enclosed environment, with that being as sweet as it is, you'd probably choke some people out. So, this is, and she definitely picked a good fragrance for tonight's occasion, a, a big environment. Maybe you're going to a, uh, who knows, a, uh, what do they call it? Maybe you're going to a concert. Who knows? You're going to be in those huge big arena and you got to be wide open you want to smell good you want to you want people to see you hey this one right here the thunderstorm the lightning in a bottle if you will carolina herrera the lay parfum i believe this is it is yes it is the, the parfum see right there but this is a very good fragrance i actually like this and again the real reason why i bought it or the wifey actually bought this one for me uh was because i wanted to do a a 420 video, maybe next 420 we'll do that. So we got a ways, a ways away to get to that 420. Although some of you guys probably celebrate 420 every day, but we'll wait for that special day. So with that being said, the wifey actually did pick out a good fragrance. She went over there, she looked for something loud. She went for something that kind of is a open fragrance. Right? Like, what do you think of this fragrance? It's actually one of my favorites. It's what I was thinking of, and I can so, smell through the bottle. As you guys can see, because some of you guys have asked as well. You guys said, hey, let her talk more. Let her describe what she's smelling. Let her pick her favorites. And so there you go. So she does like Le Parfum. So if you guys don't know what to get, or ladies, maybe you're watching this right now. Maybe you don't know what you'd like on your man. You can get some Le Parfum, the Thunder Edition, the Le Parfum they have plenty of others. The Cobalt Blue, I believe, is supposed to be real good. The original. Uh, and then Carolina Herrera makes very good woman fragrances, too. They got the shoe, the high heel shoe. That's I don't their, own that one. She does not own that one, but we will eventually get it for her. I, we'll get her one of those high heel ones. He, um, uh, he actually got me my uh, Dior fragrance that I wanted. So, and it was a bit more expensive. So. Yes, so... Uh, with that being said, the wifey, she did a good job. She picked out a fragrance. She went based off of occasion or situation, if you will. Like I said, remember, go based off the occasion, the situation. And your life. Research, okay? If you're going to a wedding, okay? If it's only like a small wedding, remember, you don't want to be as loud. But if it's a big wedding, go loud. So go off bigger, the home. situation, okay? But there you go. That is... Carolina Herrera Le Parfum, the lightning in a bottle, if you will. The wifey picked that out herself. And uh, as you guys can see, I sniffed it, blindfolded it, and got it right. He did. Now, let's see how many of you, and honestly, I haven't wore this in a long time. I probably he hasn't. You I, see, I, it I has think dust. I, bought, I think the last time I smelled it was at the Ulta, and that was probably four months ago. So, as you guys can see... This nose is trained. This nose is trained to sniff out fragrances like dogs sniff out crotches and drugs. So with that being said, we are going to get up out of here. We got a wrestling show to attend. Hopefully The Rock and The Undertaker make a special appearance today because I don't know who the hell the wrestlers are nowadays. I don't think she even knows the wrestlers. She, I mean, she's probably just going there to look at muscular guys. Who knows? I don't know. Anyways, 
I'm we are going to get up out of here. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed that video. And if and you guys did, the food. Hit the likes. Yeah, hopefully the food is good. Uh, we'll be spending money there for that, Hope I think. Uh, pretty expensive Whole when you paycheck. go. Hope you, you literally got to take out a loan before you go to an event or movies. Oof. But with that being said, we are going to get up out of here. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. Hopefully you guys were entertained. Hopefully you guys will continue to watch, subscribe, and like, and Thanks enjoy. Thanks for inviting so, me back. I wish I had a voice. <clears throat> She is kind of under the weather, but we are going anyways to the wrestling event. We are giving everyone the under the weather stuff. Who cares? Nah. I'm just She's kidding. Not I, I, I was She a just week didn't ago. drink enough water before this video. I just never got my voice back. So, that being said, peace.